Anchor a cable at knee height, stand sideways a couple feet away from it, and grab it with your outside hand. With your feet hip width apart and toes pointing forward, line up the inside foot so the cable lines up over that foot arch, and bring the outside foot forward so that heel lines up roughly with the opposite big toe. The inside foot will be the working side, so plant the inside edge of the heel arch and ball of big toe firmly into the ground in order to counter the lateral cable resistance pulling you toward the tower. You should see your kneecap line up with the second toe and your stance hip align over that foot prior to starting your reps. If you don't do this, you'll notice the knee spins out, the toes lift, and that hip won't be able to load as you go into the hinge. Keeping your free hand on the working hip, feel it flex as you hinge into your available range, maintaining the foot pressure. Because the cable's coming from across your body, it will help your zipper turn toward the inside leg as you hinge to fully lengthen the backside and outer glute fibers. To drive up, push through the inside edge of the heel and foot arch without pushing your hips forward of the heel, and you'll feel the same glute fibers shorten to contract. As always, start with light weight and move slowly to make sure you're working in the instructed position. Feel out your available hip range and let that determine how deeply you hinge and drive up each rep.